let me tell you this. AI will not replace you in the nearest future, but people who know how to optimize their work with AI will. That's why I encourage you to regularly explore AI tools available on the market and integrate the ones that work for you into your life, into your work. I consistently incorporate new paid and free applications into my workflow. And not only has it saved me tens of thousands of dollars, it also allows me to spend more time on meaningful tasks instead of just doing routine work that could have been done without me. I've already shared a selection of tools that have changed my life, but as I mentioned, my team and I are always testing something new. So it's time to introduce you to a fresh batch of incredible AI apps that are worth checking out. So if you follow me on Instagram, and if you don't, please do follow me. I am Lingua Marino on Instagram. I've recently shared how I've attended a Google event where they presented their AI features and uh, Gemini AI. Oh my God, guys, if you're using Gmail, I think you've already seen those new features because they're starting to roll them out. And Gmail now has this feature where it can summarize the email for you and get the most important information. And another thing, if you used Google products, you probably started noticing a lot of different things. There is also the Gemini feature in their app. So you can basically take a photo and ask Google what's going on here. I recently saw a skeleton in our driveway, kind of large skeleton, and I didn't know who this was so i took a picture as google and google told me it's a small mammal and i was like oh wow so basically you can ask anything with a photo this is something i've been doing a lot recently asking google different questions and getting a reply in return another feature that they've released to certain users and check if you have it is going to change the way we watch youtube for example if you watch your travel vlog on youtube and plan a trip to that destination you can ask gemini to list all the restaurants mentioned in the video and pinpoint them on google maps or Another feature that they demonstrated uh, during the event is you can snap a photo of a concert flyer and ask Gemini if you're free on a day when your favorite band is coming to your city and even set a reminder to buy tickets. This is starting to feel more like the work of a real personal assistant and it's only gonna get better from now on. And I encourage you to keep an eye on the development on AI assistant field in general as they're already taking over many tasks. As of this video, Gemini Live is available to advanced subscribers along with conversational overlay on Android. They're rolling out even more features and will make it available to everyone soon. Make sure to keep checking when you have access to these features. Now, the next tool that I want to talk about is called 11 Labs, and this is actually my team's favorite tool. The thing is, sometimes I record a video and there are small issues. Maybe I mispronounced something. Maybe, you know, the brand got back and said, you know, Marina, we really wanted to change the messaging. Can you say 30% off instead of 20% off? Can you change this and that? But we travel five or six months a year. We're gonna travel less this year with Emily starting school. But anyways, we travel a lot. And I don't take this mic with me. Sometimes I don't have any mics with me. Sometimes I am with my kids 24 seven, so it's impossible to do anything. Like go to a studio and carve out the time for re-recording things. So basically what we did, I recorded my voice in 11 labs using different mics that I have at home. I have this mic, I have another mic upstairs. I have a couple of lav mics. I record, oh, and also with my phone. So I recorded my voice and we have different samples of my voice, which my team later uses to replace voice in some videos. And if we need to change the messaging, they basically type in whatever we need to change create a voiceover using my existing samples. And when we put it in the video, we just replace the A roll, the, the video itself with some B roll of me doing something, or maybe like a screencast of a product that we're presenting. Guys, it made my life so much easier because prior to 11 labs, our editing process was like, oh, Marina, here are the things you will need to re-record. It would be like, oh my God, okay, uh, sitting down, re-recording. Now, I don't even hear about those things. My team manages the communication with, you know, native speakers who look through my videos. Uh, they manage communication with brands and 11 Labs does the voiceovers. How awesome is that? On top of that, the AI in 11 Labs perfectly mimics my intonation and, and even keeps my accent. And that's what my AI voice sounds like. Pretty convincing, right? So if you're creating content, check it out. This is perfect tool to create your AI voice. The next tool is Active Campaign. Active Campaign is an all-in-one platform for intelligent email and marketing automation, and it's also the sponsor of today's video. Active Campaign leverages AI-powered automations to help you create content, run smart omni-channel marketing campaigns, managing and segment your audience, and craft email marketing that drives results. Essentially, this AI tool handles all the tasks you typically need to hire a separate digital marketing specialist for. Here are the key features I particularly like about Active Campaign: AI Brand Kit, create 
your brand's identity in just a few clicks. AI suggested segments effortlessly segment your audience with AI driven insights, allowing you to focus on high level leads and boost engagement. Campaign calendar view let AI calculate the best time and day to send your campaigns for maximum impact. AI powered content generation empower marketers to brainstorm, compose, and refine content to perfection. Active campaigns research shows that customers save up to 20 hours a week with automation, and the results speak for themselves. One user boosted their click through rate by 786% in just three months, while another saw a 47% increase in email interaction. Pretty impressive, right? Give Active Campaign a try today and see how AI can transform your business. Visit ActiveCampaign.com to get started. I will leave the link in the description under this video. And remember the most important marketing rule, no emails, no sales. Another feature that I really like from the Google conference was pixel screenshots. It basically allows you to save, optimize, and quickly recall information from your screenshots. I don't know about you guys, I screenshot things all the time. And yes, I have this album with my screenshots, but ideally I would have a Pinterest-like dashboard with all my screenshots. And this is basically what they created. If you have a screenshot of a door code of an upcoming vacation, but can't remember it when you arrive, you can simply ask pixel screenshots to find it for you quickly and easily. And again, this app is currently available only on Google Pixel phones, but I think they're gonna release it to all devices, hopefully. Let me know if you have a million screenshots in your phone's gallery. Claude AI. Claude AI is another chatbot that primarily works with text-based information. It can help you summarize documents, PDFs, links, answer questions about complex topics based on lengthy documents, translate between languages, and even write code. What I specifically like about Claude is its copywriting ability. I have a lot of text that I have to write. First of all, scripts for the videos. Uh, most of the time, what, what I used to do was dictate something to my researcher or to someone who helps me with the script, they will create a doc from it, it would take a while. Or if I'm doing an interview, I will send voice recordings to my assistant and she will create answers for that interview. What I do now, I use Claude or one other app that I'm gonna mention as well. I answer all the questions and it creates various texts and I can tell Claude that this is a script for a video, can you make bullet points? Or I can say this is email, can you make it sound as if I'm emailing a friend? And it does a fantastic job with hardly any need for editing from my site, which is just, again, perfect. Just saves so much time and money. And of course, there are tons of AI writing assistants. Even ChatGPT can handle this task. But I think Claude is the best at capturing the nuances of style and producing lively, engaging text. So if you haven't tried it yet, I highly recommend it. And if you're still writing text yourself, uh, let AI take over this task starting today because there is another app on the market. And this is super exciting for me because this is VoicePal and it's created by Ali Abdal, a fellow creator. Let me tell you more about this app. I've been using the free version I'm running out of text. I think they give, let me show you. So basically Voicepell gives you five free texts up to 25 minutes. I already used four. I use them on scripts for some of the classes that we're recording. So if you've ever struggled with writing, you'll find this voice very helpful. So basically Ali markets it as having a ghostwriter in your pocket. You open the app, you start recording, you start speaking, and you just say whatever's on your mind, and it'll transcribe everything you say, and when you're done, you can hit a button to turn it into a draft for an article, Instagram post, email, or whatever else you need to write. So I haven't used this functionality yet where it transforms into a blog post or whatever, but I've used it for audio to text, and I think it works perfectly well. The next app is called Aphonic, and this is another great tool for fellow content creators who want to save some time and money on audio editing. It's especially useful for podcasters, but you can edit any audio with it. Just upload your audio file to the app and it will automatically balance the volume between speakers and music. I just remember how I used to edit, when I used to edit the videos myself, I used to work on the audio level manually. Like you were looking for those peaks and you were kind of bringing them down, sometimes suppressing the whole audio file. It's incredible how progress works. Anyways, it reduces background noise, it cuts out silent segments, pauses, and filler words like uh, mm, in multiple languages. It will not fully replace a professional sound designer or engineer, but if you're trying to keep your team lean, this is a perfect tool for working with audio. Speaking of personal assistants, you no longer need to get distracted during meetings by taking notes or bringing in someone just for that task. Otter AI is a tool that you can use. Otter Pilot, Otter joins Zoom, Google Meet, and Microsoft Team meetings to take notes automatically, letting everyone participate fully. After the meeting, Otter generates a 30-second summary to keep everyone 
everyone informed and save your time. It also identifies tasks and action items from the conversation and assigns them to specific team members. The next tool I'm very excited about, I've just started using it, uh, but I can already see how powerful it is. So some context, when I studied in 2010, I went to study in Germany and uh, my field is called mathematics and economics, which involves a lot of coding, which I'm not good at. I studied R, I studied Gretel, I studied C++, I studied Statistica and I didn't really like coding, but I love the world of academia and uh, I started my, I wouldn't call it research assistantship, but I'm part of a lab at Stanford that researches creator economy. And I need to write code for it. But of course, I'm going to use AI tools and hopefully they're going to help me. So for this task, I'm using Gemini Code Assist. It enhances coding by auto completing code, generating code blocks on demand and supporting over 20 programming languages like Java, Python and C++. It allows large scale code based changes, including feature additions, version upgrades and comprehensive code reviews, all powered by Google Gemini 1.5 Pro model. So basically, if you're a student, and you've learned the basics of coding, but it goes really, really slow for you, there are AI tools now that can help you with that. That's all the AI tools I wanted to share with you today. If you're using any AI tools that I didn't mention, let me know in the comments. I'd love to discover something new. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.